Hi guys, welcome back to the university. I'm just the dean, the dean, the composer. Here's the thing: you can uh, go to http://getcomposer.com okay? or that word rather. And uh, 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 yeah, to install it. All right. So, but before anything else, please click the subscribe button. Notification bell to get updated whenever I post new videos like this. We are making uh, physics videos in uh, physics lectures, science lectures in two versions one in the English version, so you can check it all right here. Alright, so let's go ahead and uh, go back to the um, website wherein we can download the composer. So here we go. So right here, is uh, states that Composer is a dependency manager for PHP. So I assume that you all have your PHP okay, installed. All right. So download get uh, download your uh, exam, and then uh, PHP and other things that you need for your computer programming will be uh, there. All right. So getting started. So we will see the documentation here and we can go to the downloads okay so here is how we can actually install the yeah so the composer in two versions so one is to download this one all right so let's click this so that's here i don't know if you can see but yeah so there is uh, this type of file can harm your computer, so do you want to keep this composer setup away? So we can keep it, right? So we can go to yeah. So that's the first uh, thing. We'll download, all right? So I know you know. I know that you can see it. So let's just click install. All right. So open it. There you go. It prompts something and you cannot see it because it's an application and OBS is not uh, uh, readily uh, reacting to the changes in the screen. So it's not, <laughs> yeah, you will see that uh, there's no screen recording rather. So I'm just going to read, select install mode. Install for all users. So I'm going to only for me all right just by clicking that it will be installed in my tab php uh, backslash php dot yet right so that will be the directory and then when you click next guys okay ready to install so my php version is 7.2 not yet there but uh, I don't know if I can let's see if I can uh, show you yeah so this one this is the composer setup I'm sorry okay so you can go back and uh, check go back. so once you click install here we go Setup uh, will install Composer to pick location for the current user. Okay, so hindi ko kasi install siya para sa lahat ng password protecto ng computer. Um, the main user will be me and other users will not be able to use the uh, Composer if they wish. Okay, so uh, that's another layer of security. So, okay. so this includes a control panel, an installer, and uh, blah blah blah. Click next, and there we go. You will see that uh, the directory is on C. Alright, exam php backslash php.d. Alright, so you can change it, but uh, since this is the uh, uh, what do you call that default, so you can go next, and there we go. So use the proxy uh, URL. So uh, this one, I didn't know what is this, so let's just leave it for that. And uh, this is my PHP version, so I'm currently running at uh, 7.4.27. So, yeah. And uh, 
there is a path there so we'll automatically add the path okay click next install so we are installing the This week while well, set up the post control. Oh yeah. Wonderful. Alright, so I'm going to so um this will be useful to you. We're going to change something. Or yeah. Change something or to check whether you have this code also. So you must open a, uh, a new command prompt window, so let's just do that. Alright. Alright, so we'll follow this step now. Okay. So, yeah. And, uh, okay. Let me open my command prompt. cannot see anything in the command prompt so we can uh, try to check if composer is loaded by typing composer all right so yeah there we go me i can see it i do not know if you can see it too so yeah so once again i'm gonna show it to you So yeah, so you just have to type it like this, closer. There we go. So what are these things? Alright, so these are the available commands about archive, browse, check, config, and then create project. So this uh, codes or commands will be helpful to you if you're going to uh, use the Alright, so now I can um, use uh, JSON file without without any problem, right? So, <laughs> so that's it. We can uh, wherever the file is, if uh, um, it is classified in the directory, right? So you will be able to load the file without any problem. All right. So that's how we use the composer, guys. So I hope you were able to understand how. Uh, yeah, things work for the composer, <laughs> right? So guys, bye bye and see you next time. So I hope you uh, great to learn something.